this spring it's getting green Fisher on the bed and hear those turkeys gobble It's ringing in my head The winter rides the bass boat Here comes another year Yeah, we command the outdoors round here Hi, I'm Kevin Reese with JustHunt.com. I'm here looking at the Spy Point Tiny W2. This is second generation Spy Point Tiny W camera. It shoots uh, still photos in 8 megapixels. It'll also film video from 10 to 90 seconds at 640, 480, which is great for YouTube. On the front of this camera, we actually have three sensors for seven zones of detection, and we have 38 LED lights. Now, the photos that I'm getting off this camera, I'm getting at least 40 feet, maybe 50 feet. It's an infrared camera. It's fantastic. On the side over here, we have an antenna. What this antenna is for is once it captures a photo image on the camera, it immediately sends a copy of that image to a little black box that I've hidden in a remote area. My black box is actually about 80 yards out in front of me uh, in some trees over there. So if anybody comes in here that's not supposed to be in here doing something they're not supposed to do, uh, maybe they're gonna, maybe they, uh, they see the camera, they have pictures taken of them, they're gonna break my camera, they're gonna steal my camera, steal the card, whatever they're gonna do. I've still got photos of them. This is a great camera, not just for uh, 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 scouting, but also great for surveillance. I love this thing. What I'm gonna do is I'm gonna slide this out of its case, slides out real easily. I'm gonna turn it around, and I actually have a 2.4 viewing window, 2.4 2. inch viewing window in the back. This is, uh, this is where I do all my settings. I switch from video to still photos. I also uh, review the photos that are on the card looking through this little window right here. It's a fantastic camera. If I flip this thing upside down and open up this little door here, it takes six AA batteries. This is where my SD card is right here. It holds up to a 32 gigabyte SD card. And then I also have a 12 volt jack right here and a USG back, a US USB jack. And they thought of everything with this camera. I love this thing. It's a great camera. It's fantastic. Um, it's, it's pretty similar to the Tiny W1. Uh, uh, but one of the things I really like about this camera is that that remote box, that black box, I set that thing out five times further on the Tiny W2 than you could with the Tiny W1. So what we're going to do real quick is I'm going to pop this thing back out and we're going to look at a couple of the pictures I've got on this one and then I'm going to go retrieve the remote black box and we're going to look at some pictures on that one and what you're going to see is that the, the pictures are identical and that's because every picture that this camera takes gets sent over to that black box. Alright, so I've got the camera here. What I'm going to do is I'm going to toggle down to view and that's where we're going to take a look at the pictures. This is also where you go to uh, adjust the camera settings and adjust from video to still photos. You can see that on the screen right there. And all you have to do is hit the button to move the cursor. So let's take a look at the pictures that we've got on this thing. It's October 7th. We're a week into archery season here. And uh, so I'm just going to scroll through some of the pictures and see what we've got. There's a deer there. Like we're getting into some hogs. So what we're going to do now is we're going to go down a range down to the tree line and get the, little, the remote black box and we're going to check the pictures on there. What I'm going to do is I'm going to take the card out of the black box put it in this camera because it has the viewfinder on it and then we'll take a look and see what's on there. All right, I stuck the card in there from the remote black box. I'm going to scroll down to view. 
hit OK. And we should be looking at the same pictures. And that's about it. It's, just, it's the uh, Spy Point Tiny W2. Takes images on the camera, sends it over the remote black box. Nobody's getting away with anything if you own the Spy Point Tiny W2. All right, I've got everything back together now. We have the Tiny W2 camera here. And I've got the remote black box right here. Just wanted to show you something with the, uh, the black box here. You unscrew the bottom of the lid here. You have your SD card there, your power button, and then this also takes six AA batteries. You put it all together, and you want to hide it within 250 feet of the camera to make sure that you're getting good copies of the images from the camera to the remote black box. This also has a 12 volt jack here. Uh, the, uh, the, the kit, when you get the kit, it includes the camera, the case, includes the remote black box, includes the straps, everything you need to catch somebody uh, uh, destroying your equipment, stealing things, poaching on your property, trespassing, or just for scouting. Great idea for scouting. One of the things I love about this camera is when it sends images from here to here, that means I don't have to come into my setup to check my cameras. I can slide in, get sort of close to my setup, but not walk in and disturb it, pull the photos off my remote black box, and then go home. I think that uh, Spy Point hit a home run with this camera. It takes great daytime pictures. It takes great nighttime pictures. And I can't say enough uh, great things about this camera. I thought the uh, Tiny W1 was a mind blower. Tiny W2 just hit it out of the park. Thanks, Spy Point. Appreciate you. What a fantastic camera. And whether you use it for scouting or surveillance, this is a great camera to have right here.